Welcome to the Multiplier Studio! Dramatic cinematic cinematic rap. Well, but words are difficult. Words, so yes, welcome to the Multiplier Studio. This is me zooming in on a thing. So there's an, an actual reason for this. It's going to be a studio vlog today, and that's because I was going to do a tutorial. In fact, I was filming tutorials as I normally do. For those that don't know, that's what I basically do all day, pretty much every day. I make tutorials, and a key part of making tutorials... Microphone, I'm going to go over... How am I going to... Wait a minute. Where should I? Where do I put my, put the microphone? In the danger zone. It's in the danger zone. You can see it's very, very dangerously, precariously balanced on top of the monitor. That's okay. So a big part of making videos is the ability for you to hear my voice. And for that to happen, you need the this this thing, the microphone, to to be working. And it's not working. Well, the microphone's working, but the cable is broken, and that of course causes problems. So then it, the whole thing doesn't work. Basically, the cable is broken and that's a bit of a disaster, but just set me back a, a fair number of days, but that's okay, it happens anyway. That means today, I'm not doing a tutorial. The, uh, tu in fact, the tutorial you saw the two days ago, three, two, um, some number of days ago, two days ago, I think probably, I actually made it about a week and a half ago. And I'm recording this before that went live. It's all very confusing. Uh, time, uh, the passage of time. Anyway, currently in uh, where in my frame of reference for time, this microphone cable is broken. So I've ordered a new one of those, and that's great. But that means today we are doing studio vlog, cable update, update on cables, all around sort of update on the situation with this guy, the Torres. Let's do a, a focus Torres SB16 professional sampler. This guy here, absolutely loving it. So much fun. But what I do need to do is use these guys that have arrived at Cables. Uh, more information about that to come. Oh, I keep forgetting. This is a microphone. As I move around the room, I forget the microphone. That's a disaster. Um, that there in the, the danger zone again. So yes, what was I saying? Oh yeah. So currently I've just been using the headphones. You can see headphones plugged in and that's cool. But really I want to plug it into my computer. And to do that, I need to go in through the sound card, both in and out. In and out, both in Dave Smith instruments. Dave's uh, Dave Dave likes it in and out. In and out, just like Dave Dave Smith. Um, so yes, that needs to go into this guy, my sound card uh, over there, and I figured it out. For those who did watch my unboxing unboxing, if you like, not unboxing, that's not a thing. For those who watched my unboxing vlog, it was very 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 long, but it's uh, it's good. Towards the end, I was trying to work out what cables I need. So let's uh, why well, solve that problem, and I will tell you my solution. If I uh, maybe zoom, get that right. Uh, I'm going to move uh, round, uh, round here, and show you the back. That's what she said. Wait, did she? I don't know. Ah, uh, oh, ah. Oh. Ooh, try not to bash into everything, multiply, you complete lunatic. I'll stop standing on things. That's probably how things get broken. Right, I'm sort of crouched down in the corner like a weird gremlin, goblin creature, trying to show you the back, and it's still very difficult. Ow! 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 It's like yoga. I'm doing yoga in the studio, everybody. Right, okay. Oh, this angle looks awesome, but I'm going to fall into a million pieces. I'm too old for this. I'm too old for crouching down in the corner of a room. What am I? This is ridiculous. Okay, anyway, um, that angle looks really cool. As a side note, maybe if I, whoa, look at that, that angle is good. So that angle is super fly, mega dope. Um, but yes, what I'm trying to show you is the back, uh, the holes, um, and it's still quite hard to really see. But basically, they are holes. Holes you put cables, quarter inch cables, TR, well, no, no, not the R. The headphone will be TR, but the, the, the See my cable on balanced versus unbalanced headphones. No, balanced versus unbalanced cables for more information about what I mean by TRS for what I'm, T for, um, it's so hard to talk and think in the corner of the room, crouch down like a yoga thing. So these holes are quarter inch, ow! <laughs> Ah, uh, this is, this isn't, okay, I'm gonna stand up. This is, I'm just gonna tell you. Uh, uh, ow, ow, things are breaking. Things, this isn't, this is, the, oh, this is just a complete disaster. Ow, oh, my microphone came from that. It's, 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 it's a complete, cast, it's a catastrophe. The microphone's on the floor now, and now I'm gonna have to get it. This is a, oh. I mean, the, the talk about a day-to-day, -day, the, first of all, the, 
the microphone cable breaks. Well, that, that didn't happen today, but I, I finally diagnosed it today. So, the, oh, oh, so lose a few day making tutorials, and I was going to have to do a, a vlog. Lose a few days making tutorials, and then, then I crouched down in the corner like a, a goblin, and then I drop the microphone and it's just, oh, everything's going wrong today. Oh, okay, that, am I still even recording? Is the microphone still working? I have no idea. So, um, that's okay up there. Uh, uh, okay, uh, it's, I'm out everybody. It's okay everybody, I've uh, figured it out. I'm just not gonna stand in that corner ever again because that's ridiculous. So anyway, yes, the back of here is, I want two channels at least going out of this and two channels going in, at least. Uh, yeah, two two in and more. Uh, in fact, I've done the calculations. All I can currently do is two ins and two outs of this guy here. It's all very complicated, but that's a... Oh, I just had an idea. I just had an idea. I can maybe show you the... the. I can show you from here. I should have done... I was in the wrong corner. There you go. Oh, look at that. Okay, so you see those holes on the back? They are quarter inch holes. Can you see that? Input. Oh. Oh, oh, inputs, um, two inputs and a whole bunch, two inputs, uh, I don't know if you can read that or not, two inputs, and then the ones on the right are a whole bunch of outputs. So what I'm gonna do is get two going in, and then, and then, actually, for example, there were uh, two going in and two going out. And then, okay, so that, so this is the comparatively simple side of the equation. Ins and outs, quarter inch, unbalanced it turns out, but that's okay, it's not the end of the world. And it turns out that that's perfectly cool because of what I'm going to have to do uh, on my sound card end. I mean, I've uh, solved the problem. You can see cables and stuff up there, cables and stuff up there. But let's go around to the other side of the room and I'll explain what I figured out about my sound card. Oh, bumped into the chair. Classic multiplier there. That's a rhyme. Oh, I should be a rap, rap rapper, a, a rap, rap star. That's, I can be what I can be one day. Okay, awesome. Okay, and the boss. Oh, oh, now I'm here. I'm going to shout at the kid. You stupid cable. What are you doing? Why did you break? You didn't even last a year. You're supposed to have a lifetime warranty. I'll sort that out. Once I confirm it is definitely the cable that caused the problems. Anyway, okay, this is from the, the other side of the room and um, cool, so sound card. Now that's really important I don't stand on mad cableage. It's really important I don't stand on these cables because that is how they get broken. I mean, I haven't stood on the cables after uh, I, after I stood on a, after I stood on the first cable and it's a, I know not to stand on cables now. Anyway, so the back of here has a whole bunch of ins and outs. If I can get the focus right. Hey! I, it, brilliant, because this is, I was, if I get the focus right on the camera, the, the focus, like, focus, if I get the focus right, on the focus right, because it's a focus right, I'm tilting, okay, there you go, see, focus, focus right, the focus, focus right, I'm focusing right on the focus right, this is me to be. Okay, so I'm crouching down like a yoga thing, gremlin, goblin again. So I am trying to get, figure out the angles here. Um, I thought it's true at all. Ah, my arm's hurting now. Ah. Oh. So some of these are out, some are ins, and then, okay. A very, very roundabout way of, in fact, let me show you where I have three. Look at that. So I should have, I didn't think this through. So when I ordered cables, I only ordered half, I actually only ordered half the number of cables I need. I. Okay, I'm some, I sometimes, I'm a bit, that's okay. So what I will do is, so these are outputs, I think. Yes, outputs, you can like get the focus right on the focus right. You can just about see, it says outputs down there, probably on the right hand side, and there's a two availables. Two holes, that means two outputs. So what I'm going to do is get a cable, uh, two cables in fact, because there's two holes. Ah, oh, crouching down was difficult, Ooh, bumped into that. Uh, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna get two cables running into the dude over there, the TP16, which is all the way over there. You can just about get the focus right. Awesome, so that's gonna be one half of the equation, eh? Um, and the other part is getting the output, the, probably the more important in the short term, getting the output of the TP16 into the sound card. So the sound card can then send the information into my computer. This digital to analog converter, DAC. Remember, this, the, the TP16 is analog and the computer is digital. Anyway, the thing that I figured out the other day, because uh, after in that vlog, in the vlog, you may remember I was talking about this SPDIF, those guys, the, 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 whoop, those guys there, and I was wondering, what are they on about? What is that? 
and I, and I read the manual and figured it out. So there's two, this is very confusing. I needed to read the manual to really understand this. But yes, there are two things that look like RCAs. And on it says in next to one and out on the other. Very confusing because that's not what they are. Let me show you on the manual. On the manual, if I can somehow, ah, oh, don't stand on the cable, don't stand on the cable. Uh, 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 okay, ah, that was uh, very difficult. Oh, Ooh, that was, uh, I don't want to stand on the cables otherwise. If I stand on those cables, then those cables break. And I'd, hope, and I'd have even more broken cables, so it should be bad. Anyway, so let's uh, turn the microphone around. It's still in the danger zone. That's okay up there. Ooh. And yes, yeah, so this is the, oh, I'm gonna sit down. This is the, I'm out of breath because of all the yoging. Oh, okay. So what I figured out in the manual is, there you go, look at that. That looks really cool, doesn't it? Get the focus right. Maybe like, whoop, whoop. there you go. SPDIF in and out. Whew, I'm out of breath. Whoa. Okay. Two Phono RCA sockets, they are RCAs, carrying two digital, audio signals in, wait a minute, but they're digital. Okay, this might not work. Digital audio signals in, digital or, the, hmm. Digital audio, is that a different thing? Not a digital cable, is it? Um, Okay, I may have ordered the wrong cable. What I'm going to do now, I should have written have read more carefully. I'm going to do some Googling. Big BRB. No! 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 Disaster! I think I have actually bought the wrong cables. What an idiot! Ah, uh, I should I should have read that more carefully. I just saw RCA, and I, I didn't. I should have. Uh, it is a cable disaster. This is the worst day in the history of all cables. Why? Ah, uh, it is digital audio. I should have known that. That's. I even kind of had a suspicion, but I didn't really. Didn't think I just got excited. So this is a lesson in reading things. Um, oh, I should have spent more than four seconds looking at the manual before I uh, bought some cables. Oh no, this is a complete disaster. Now I have cables I don't need. Stupid, this is stupid. This is, ah, oh, okay. Let's hopefully somebody can learn from this. So, Hopefully this illustrates some points. Some points about, um, to, first of all, read the manual. Don't just spend four seconds reading the manual. Spend six or seven seconds, which is about how long it took me to actually figure out what I was. Um, see, this is all not even relevant now, is it? Oh. You see, it's, it says, it's a two. Mm. See, I just did, I, I, I uh. Okay, so let's let's do some. So it turns out that what well, I I knew the ah oh, don't idiot 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 see idiot ah oh, I need analog. So it turns out that SPDIA stupid. It stands for stupid. SPDIF stands for stands for stupid, pointless, dumb. Idiotic. F um, what do you call the F? Stupid, SP, SPDIF stands for stupid, pointless, dumb, idiotic. That's just me. Ah, the cable, okay, so I bought an RCA cable. It's a, let's go back to the other side of the room. Oh, now I have to, I was quite excited, I was really excited, and now, ah. Oh. This this day is a complete disaster, a complete disaster. It's what that's what is going on. What is so? I bought um, I bought twenty five foot of cable that now I can't use. RCA stereo audio cable, and I've got no use for that now. I've absolutely no use for that. Uh, all I can really think to do is, ooh, and let mail to. So okay, ooh, okay, okay. I've saved the day. Not really. 
I've slightly saved the day. Okay, so okay, this isn't too bad. This is just this is just not perfect and bad, it's, but it's not a complete disaster. So what I ordered is an RCA twenty five foot twenty five. I want to put another battery in. Uh, I want to put another battery in because battery's running low. Um, oh, I had a little system which checks out. Did you see that? I don't know. I'll hold it the other hand. Oh, let's see. And then it goes in. That actually went in. That actually went in. That went in. Oh my God. There you go. Charging. And now, uh, look at that for workflow. Okay, so I bought a. Um, so uh, let's go to the other side of the room. Can you still hear me? Ah! Oh, I nearly, nearly broke everything. I tripped, but I didn't. It's okay. So RCA is. Um, why am I doing around here? That's okay, we're here now. So RCA, I'm going to get a firm footing. Oh, I've got firm footing, so yeah. So, okay, this is, okay, this is, can you still hear me? So, over at the back, this is my, this is where I made a mistake. So I saw those RCA socket types. So that is so RCA, here's where, here's where I made the mistake. I forgot that cables are different to the actual end, things on the end of the cables, the connectors. So I mistakenly jumped. I just didn't really think it through. So, there, so there are most so most cables are analog cables, at least in the world of uh, audio stuff. So it's like speaker cables and uh, microphones and all that sort of stuff. These are analog cables, but it turns out SPDIF is digital, which is stupid. I'm sure it's good for some things, but it's not it's not useful for me. But it's because uh, I saw those RCA connectors and thought they were RCA analog cables, and then I bought a cable for it. So I oh, thought I was really clever reading the manual, looking at how it works, and it turned out I wasn't, I was an idiot. So that is a digital output, it turns out. You, well, you can basically make it two in or two out in the, the software. So it's, it's kind of inputs and outputs, but it's basically digital, which is not what I want. I, I want analog. So the sound comes out of here in analog, and then, so this comes out in analog and the SPDIF, except digital, which is bad. Anyway, so I bought an RCA cable, uh, RCA analog cable, because that's basically what RCA means implicitly. Um, even though RCA is a connector, uh, it turns out. So RCA analog cable, 25 feet, which is all the way around the room in feet. There you go, 25 feet. And I bought these connector dudes, like that, to turn the uh, to, for the into the here. Does that make sense? Because there's no RCA port on this guy, the Torres SP16. So what I did is I got these guys and I was gonna convert, use these guys to I even get the right ones. Yeah, pretty shredded. So yeah, I've got this uh, female, female RCA to TS cable. Now you're probably thinking if you've seen my T, the video about balance versus unbalanced, but balanced versus unbalanced cables. Why did I go for a TS cable and not a TRS cable? Because TRS is balanced if it's mono, uh, and that's because RCA isn't balanced. So no need for the R, no need for the ring, just tip and sleeve. Therefore, what I so here's 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 where the day hasn't been a complete disaster, but just quite a big disaster. So this cable, I can actually plonk these guys because they came in a pack of six, which I only I need, needed two. Turned turned it out it. That uh, it's good it came in a pack of six because now I'm going to use four of them. Because I can put these guys on the end of these and turn that into just a normal unbalanced TR cable. Which, which is that looks cool, doesn't it? With the the way they all it's all got out of sync with the frame rate. That looks that's not how it looks to me, by the way. This is just the camera and the frame rate. And the way it sinks. That's, that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Ooh, so that doesn't do anything. So it's the way the camera, so th these are all sta static colors to me the way, through my eyes, but through the camera because of the frame rate. You see, it looks different. Anyway, so yes, I can turn this into a TR cable um, just by plonking these on the end, uh, which isn't too bad because this has unbalanced outs. So I can just plug that in. So now, now I haven't solved, how am I going to get it back? But that doesn't solve how I'm going to get it into there properly. That looks cool, doesn't it? Anyway, okay, maybe, but okay. So there are two free outputs on that guy. So I could plug the outputs of that now into the inputs of the Torres TP16. Might make me feel better about today. In fact, I will do that. That doesn't solve how you're going to hear the sound when I show you the thing, 
because because I that because that's just getting sound into this and not sound out. So I've got to figure out next. I'll, I'll, pl I'll plug that in. Don't, don't worry. So that's uh, I can I can just use that as inputs um, in, an input if you like. So I'll use that as the input vibe uh, inputting or going from the sound card into this the Tori SP16. So that's what I'll use that for. So it's not a complete disaster, which is not what I intended. And I haven't actually now solved the problem of how I'm gonna get sound into this thing. So here it bumps into the chair again, right? So here, here are the options. I could go in through the front, but that's, but I don't really like doing that because then it's more cables out the front and then that, that drives me crazy. Um, might have to, but I don't really want to. Um, it's also just mono. I don't really want mono. Well, I don't want, I definitely don't want mono. So. The question is, how do I get stereo? So how do I do that? Um, let's see what's available around the back. So what is going into this thing? So we have microphone out the front, can't touch that. And also I don't like going out the front. Uh, although as, as, as I say, I might have to. Can you still hear me? That's fine. Probably. And so then these are all taken up. With the, so these two on the right hand side, uh, these guys, these two on the right hand side, these are inputs coming from the Arturia drum root. Let me go back and show you that. Ooh, we're not tripping it into everything. Oh, oh didn't step on anything, anything. That's good. Righteous. So yes, the two current inputs to, into the sound card is this guy here, the Arturia drum root. So what I could do, I mean, it's, it's just not really what I want, but temporarily until I figure this thing out, I could just swap the outputs from the drum root the, the light's coming in, that's, I don't know if I like that or not. Yeah, it just looks a bit weird, with the light coming in from the window. Anyway, I could put that, now it's all, it's, it's, it's really cool, isn't it? That's not how it looks, that's the uh, uh, the frame rate thing. So I could get the outputs from the, the drum brute and just plonk them into the outputs from here, but that's not ideal. Um, okay, I think I need, well, in fact, I know I, I, know I need, because I basically, I, I like having, I don't, basically, I don't want to compromise the outputs on the drum brute. On the drum brute, I have a main out, let me show you, let me show you. Step around here, step around here on the drum brute, I have a, a main out, which is everything apart from anything you root out separately. So I've got this floating one, which I call a floating one. Ooh, you didn't focus. So this is the floating one, and then this is the main out. So this, the main out has everything apart from what's on the separated out. So this separated out is the clap, and then I've got the main out. Therefore, oh, also note uh, the individual out, so the clap goes out before the filter, which so you can do really cool things like, uh, in fact, do you see my Arturia drum root video? See how I did it, but you can have, say, the clap going out unfiltered, so just a, a clap going out separately into Ableton, process that, and then you have your main out coming out of this, uh, but say low passed. So you have all your toms and your kicks and everything, and your hi hats are low passed, which is really cool, and then the clap separated, so it just separation and fun and, 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 and vibranting. So that's cool. I don't want to compromise that. I think I'm, I'm starting to realize I need a mixer. I think I need. I think I need a mixer. I think I need more, well, I need either more inputs and outputs on the sound card, but I don't have to buy any sound card. Oh, too much. Oh, so that's, so I basically, I've concluded, I've concluded I either need, well, I'm gonna plug that cable in uh, after I finish this video. I'm gonna plug in those cables to do the input into the Torres. So going from the sound card into, I'm probably really, Really off to the side, so let's twist the microphone a bit. There you go. So, whoop, whoop, nearly fell over. Um, so I'm going to have the inputs for the Torres, so the connection going out of the sound card into the Torres, with those cables, that's fine. So I, 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 I am actually going to use those cables, so not a complete disaster. And then, because of all these other output issues, I mean, like I said, I do want more outs coming out of the drum brute, and ideally separated outs coming out of the sampler as well. So I think I've come to the conclusion right now that it's probably best, in fact, actually, to give me the most options long term to buy a mixer. So that's what I'm going to do. I need to do some research into that because I know almost nothing about mixers. So when I talk about a mixer, I'm talking about a big, big thing uh, with a bunch of like faders on it, inputs and outputs, and it's, it's, it's quite primitive, but it's just got faders and inputs and outputs. So you can combine, say, wait, will that even do what I want? Um, just thinking, thinking through, that might not actually do everything I wanted to do. No, that's actually, 
actually. Thinking through why I would want separated. No, that won't work. That won't work. Oh, no. Or will it work? So, so with the mixer, it would be combining. So it's really... So conceptually, I'm thinking out loud here, conceptually, the advantage of having separate ins and outs in the sound card is it means I can process them individually in the DAW in, say, Ableton. Um, which I couldn't do if it summed together in a mixer. So the only real advantage to get in a mixer is it would save me having to move move the cables about. I could just say plug all these cables in, and then currently, if I wanted to say root out the tom, I'd have to pull the cable out and then put it in the tom. Whereas if I had a mixer, I could root them all out, and then in the mixer, I could say pull up the tom or pull pull up the clap or or, or whatever. Mm. So that might actually not do what I want to do. Or it might. Okay, I need to do some research. I'm going to do some research because as we found out today with the SPDIF debacle, d d d disaster, yeah, disaster, um, I need, need to not so impulsively just uh, assume things will work. So that's for knowledge. Hopefully some of you have learned from this that there's a difference between the connection type, for example. So knowledge here. There's a difference, there's a difference between connection type and... Uh, I'm going to get distracted if I keep trying to be focusing. So there's a difference between connection type and the cable itself. That's one bit of knowledge. Also, read the manual. Otherwise, you'll be an idiot like me. So hopefully that's knowledge or, or, or learning or something. Next video, back to tutorials. Catch you guys on the flippity flip.